WaveAgent is a simple tool to view WAV files, their metadata, and to playback those files. Let's go ahead and take a look. We're in Mac OS 10.9. We launch WaveAgent after we've downloaded it from Sound Devices site. And you see a file list up top and file detail down below. The first thing we do is import files. We can import files from a dialog box or more simply by dragging folders directly into the file list. So we can take a folder, drag it in, and any file that's in that folder, in this case there's one, gets imported. We can see specific elements of this file, its number of channels, in this case it's a 32 channel polyfile. We also, when we hover over it, we see the path. Scene and take information, time code, date of the file, sampling, frame rate, and more. And in, so this is a summary of any file that's imported into the Wave Agent application. Down below is where we can edit some of that metadata. One of the things that's quite common to do is play the file. We can double click on the file, and that file is played. You see here in the playback mixer, we can adjust individual track levels. We can also see track names that come through, and we can do that for up to files with 32 tracks of information. Another common tool is to split a file, and in this case, this poly file, we're going to split it, and we're going to split it into its individual 32 channel mono files. So let's go ahead and select a folder to do this, and we're going to put it into the mono sound files folder. We're going to go back in here, and we've processed it. So when we look at this folder, we see a list of all the individual files that have now made up this poly file. One of the things we can do is we can throw this right back into WaveAgent and all we did was take one of the files of that mono grouping and you can see it listed here as a single entry as a single entity of a 32 channel monophonic WAV file. So anything we do with this is going to affect any of the files within the group. So we can quickly play this back just as we can with the polyphonic file. So that's a very brief look at WaveAgent. There's additional tools within WaveAgent, 788T control mode, and some of the batch file conversion, and we can explore those in additional videos. Thank you.